really sneak in under your coat, under your scarf today. We've got the clouds, and every once in a while, we see a stray snow flurry flying by. It's cold, 19 here in Des Moines. It feels like three above because of that brisk wind. The wind today coming in from the northwest, and it's not as strong as it was yesterday and Saturday night, but it's still really brisk, about 20 miles per hour. We have some higher gusts, closer to 25, 30 miles per hour, just enough to make you want to stay indoors and maybe get a nice hot beverage. The wind chills, even this midday, still below zero. Algona feels like two degrees below zero. And it's not much better to the south. Lamona feels like five above. Make sure you're bundling up if you've got to be out there scooping snow. Live Super Doppler, well, was showing a little bit of flurry activity moving in from north central Iowa, moving toward Boone, Ames, Story City, Jewel, over toward Collins and Marshalltown. This won't be accumulating snows, just some wind whip flurries out there for your afternoon to remind you that, yeah, it's cold. Highs are only going to be in the 20s. That's way too cold for this time of year. It should be in the 40s still. The flurries, though, are going to move out by the evening, and look at that. Temps fall like a rock back down into the single digits and teens. Now, a lot of snow just missed the metro area. South of I-80, we had over 17 inches of snow reported, and in just a couple mile span, totals were completely different. Oskaloosa tops our list at 17, Osceola 16, Bussey 15, Knoxville 14, Indianola four and a half. And you can see snow totals quickly diminish the farther north you got. Taking you hour by hour now, the afternoon clouds and flurries move out. Tomorrow looks quiet. By Wednesday evening, here comes our next chance of seeing a little bit of snow coming in. It could start as a couple of raindrops, but quickly change over to flurries by 9 p.m. Get some snow out there. That moves through already out of the area by Thursday morning. This go around, it looks like northern Iowa could see a little bit of accumulation with that. Then Thursday looks quiet. Into Friday we go. By Friday evening, temps could be warm enough for it to start out as a little bit of rain. Wouldn't that be nice? And then as we head towards Saturday morning, unfortunately, it looks like that rain is going to be switching over to some snow and lingering into Sunday. How much snow could we be expecting here by Wednesday night and Thursday morning? Maybe another skiff for central Iowa and upwards of an inch or two close to the Iowa-Minnesota border. So nothing heavy at all out there, but just enough to keep those roads slick. Here's your eight-day forecast. So today, just flurries. Tomorrow, sunshine and cold. There's that little bit of light snow coming in Wednesday night into early on Thursday. Thursday and Friday highs will be near 40, so that's why it's going to start out as rain Friday night. Switching over to snow on Saturday, maybe lingering into Sunday, and then we'll get a few more snowflakes coming in on Monday.